All right, we got our soil sent in about a week ago, and we got our soil report back. So I'm just going to run through real quick what you're going to see on a, on a UGA soil report. The first thing up top, the bar graph, is basically showing you your main micro, your macronutrients that you have in the soil. It's going to give you phosphorus, potassium. It gives you your calcium and magnesium. That always shows me whether or not somebody's been alignment or not. And you can see the calcium is really high, the phosphorus is really high. Uh, then you got some other nutrients out there that we pay attention to, zinc, manganese, and then your pH over here. Below that, what you'll see is the recommendation. And we don't, we don't test for nitrogen in the soil. Um, if it's a nitrogen crop that needs nitrogen, we just have recommendations based off yield. So you won't see nitrogen on there. You won't find the nitrogen in your soil without asking for a special. So what you'll see is that we recommend it over here, zero tons of lime because you're in the range of six, five to seven. Um, nitrogen, zero because you're alfalfa and alfalfa is a legume that makes its own nitrogen, so you don't need nitrogen. Um, phosphate, because the phosphate's high, it doesn't call for any phosphate. If I was giving you this report, I would say put a little phosphorus out at planting because they help the root development, especially if soils are cooler. And then your potassium, you see for, for establishment, 210 pounds of, of potassium per acre. And that's a, this is a perennial crop, so we say 210 pounds per acre per year. Um, at establishment, you could put out about a third of that. So you could put out you know 70 pounds at planting, come back again with 70 more pounds during the you know, late winter. Uh, and then if you wanted to put 70 more pounds out in the spring. And then over here, if there's any, if there, any other the micronutrients like sulfur, boron, manganese, it may have it, the recommendation here. If not, what you'll find is sometimes in, these, in the, the special notes, like you'll see apply three pounds of boron per acre. Uh, legumes like boron, the uh, brassicas like boron. Uh, legumes also, especially alfalfa, likes molybdenum. Um, so, you know, there may be some special nutrients like that, that you'll find in the notes down here. So it's always good to read this or go to your county agent and have some, have him go over with you or have her go over with you and kind of explain what you need to do. And this, this is this is the book answer. We can always tailor the book answer to what uh, your wallet will handle. So if you have any other any questions, whether it's a soil sample or whether it's just growing a crop, planting dates, seeding rates, planting depth. Um, it's always a good idea to call your county agent first. Don't call them after the fact.